Hello everyone, Xenonazuma here and welcome back to Dynasty Warriors Gundam. Last time, we did Hiro Yui's storyline. And this time I had a bit of deliberation. I thought, you know what, I might as well not bother hiding the glorious Master Asia. I did it again. And we were using the Master Gundam from G Gundam. story is not much different so we can speed through the first part of dial parts of dialogue for a while That one doesn't have many changed dialogue, but it will have changed gameplay. Well, maybe not changed gameplay, but changed how the how these missions are played. Master Asia is the odd case of the sensei of Domon Kashu, but also the villain of G Gundam. Spoilers for G Gundam. His original mobile suit that he uses was actually the King of Hearts. He's also the previous owner of the crest of the crest, the King of Hearts, making him the leader of the old shuffle lines of G Gundam. He now pilots the Master Gundam, being a servant of the Devil Gundam. And the Master Gundam is unique. He uses the mobile trace system, meaning that he can move around, move about in his mobile suit. All those actions he's doing, yeah, those are those are his movements. But it gets even crazier. Master Asia doesn't need a mobile suit to fight off these guys. He he can technically just get out of his mobile suit and just beat everyone. And yes, he does call out his attacks, all of which are amazingly named. Master Asia is also known as the Undefeated of the East, because at that point he was the Undefeated of the East. His real name is, well, no one in G Gundam knows. Now I might as well go over Might as well just start going over his specials in in the next field. Yes, I'm gonna be quiet every time time he actually speaks because Master Asia is glorious and we should not interrupt the master. And we're blocked off. <laughs> but these guys are trapped in here with us not trapped in here we're not trapped in here with us
Now you You may be wondering why God Let's use dirty finger, Hound Denaron and the Sekia Denkyokin. <laughs> Let's rush down there. And there is Domon. We shall fight Domon. Might as well explain what I was talking about with Domon being D Domon Master Asia being probably one of the strongest fighters out go pil pilots out here. I don't mean his mobile suit, even though his mobile suit is really ridiculous as well. I mean literally. He and Domon kick a 50 story 50 story skyscraper into the air without their mobile suits they just punch and kick it out the way no no help with their mobile suits just kick it no help from the enemy either I might as well also talk about why I am so over leveled with Master Asia. That's because I what I needed to check one thing for it and I need to be very high level for it. There is Domon the new King of Hearts. Fitting, very fitting and very ironic. Might as well go over Master Asia's specials right now because his level 4 specials are just literally the second time go to Gyoken again. The first is the Darkness Finger. It's honestly a worse version of the. the worst version of the burning finger in most cases in this game it's actually better than the burning finger sadly and we may understand why I'm calling it the burning finger instead of the god finger when we get to Domon. <sighs> I hate that it's called god finger in Japan this is the one case the saying special Sex special the Choku Hon Daedan I know I butchered that even though I really like G Gundam is honestly a special you'll be seeing a lot not even just outside it's just that good good in gameplay and in cutscenes apparently and the last is the Sekiad Tenkyoken there's two versions of it there's one we refer to as the tri shot Sekiad Tenkyoken and then I'm going to refer to the normal one as the actual Sekia Tenkyoken. Sadly, our guard doesn't have 
uh, the wings fold over. Even though they do in cutscenes, which is something I wish they kept in gameplay. Again, we'll ignore these because that bottom part is also the harder part to deal with. I might as well actually explain the Master Gundam, talk more about the Master Gundam now at least, because there's not really much to talk about. The Master Gundam is one of the four heavenly kings slash knights slash so many versions of what it is depending on which, which, which speaking language you're from, apparently. It's the one but it's one of the only ones that didn't really get its name changed other than, I believe, Grand Gundam? And I think that's it, because the other two got their names changed, even though they never say their names in the show, I don't believe. It's been a while since I've watched that part of G Gundam. And then it got transformed, then part of it got moulded with with all the others to make the Grand Master Gundam, which is the most stupid sight I've ever seen. It's one of the most dumb mobile suit ideas ever. Granted, it is something I, I've always wondered why they just didn't just fuse mobile suits together to see if that made anything better. Now let's take the mausoleum. Uh, small fry are no match for me. How denied ya think you can? The annoying part about Master Gundam, though, is that it sucks at taking fields. Unlike the Burning Gundam, which has at least some field-taking viability in its battling moveset, Master Gundam is literally an ace killer. It is literally built for killing aces. To the point where, really, the final boss, the final boss of every mission is literally just a joke. And let's use the Master Sash. And yes, that's what it's called. I expect to see that pose a lot. And just like that, it's already over. Granted, the first mission of Heroes was very short too, but uh, you'll start noticing Master Egypt's missions are very short for some reason. Except for his final one. But next time, we'll... Alright, skills obtained. You need skills. Pressure hit. This is actually one of the really good ones. But, next time, we'll be doing something very different and also very cool in the next episode in Iceland's
Ice fields. There will be a lot of cutscenes of Master Asia destroying icebergs. We will be getting to do that too. So, next time on Dynasty Warriors Gundam, we take to the ice fields. See you guys then. Zeno and Azuma, signing off.